Imagine a world where common infections and minor injuries can kill. Sounds like a dystopian novel, doesn't it? Well, this could be our grim reality if we don't address the rising threat of antibiotic resistance. By the year 2050, it is projected that 10 million lives a year and a cumulative 100 trillion USD of economic output are at risk due to the rise of antibiotic resistant infections if we don't find a solution. Enter the escape pathogens, six microorganisms that are rapidly becoming resistant to existing antibiotics. These crafty creatures have developed four main strategies to dodge the effects of our drugs. They can inactivate or alter the drugs, modify the drug binding sites, change their cell permeability, or form biofilms. But fear not, for the scientific community is not standing idle. Researchers worldwide are working tirelessly to outsmart these pathogens. They're exploring new therapeutic schemes such as antivirulent strategies, bacteriophage therapy, and probiotics. They're also focusing on early diagnostics and patient education to control the spread of these pathogens and prevent the emergence of new antibiotic resistant strains. With the right tools, we can join these researchers in their fight against escape pathogens. Biopathogenics offers reagent kits for early diagnostics of these pathogens. These kits are a pivotal tool in the fight against antibiotic resistance, allowing for timely and accurate diagnosis. But that's not all biopathogenics offers. As a trusted partner for laboratories, Biopathogenics provides top-grade lab supplies, including quality reagent kits, highly sensitive BPX extraction kits, multiplex qPCR reagents, attenuated pathogen quality control, and alternate proficiency testing. The time to act is now. We can't afford to let these pathogens escape our grasp. Start your fight against antibiotic resistance today. Visit the Biopathogenics website or send an email to order your kits. Together, we can work towards a future where antibiotics continue to save lives, not a world where they've lost their power.